Alright, here with Minnesota State head volleyball coach Dennis Amundsen. Uh, it's that time of year again, must be exciting for you. Uh, must feel good to get back on the court. It does feel good to get back on the court. You spend a lot of time planning for what's going to happen and then they finally arrive and now that things start to happen it will make a difference in the outcomes of the games and the matches that we play this year. Absolutely. So we're very excited about being back. Good. Uh, you have a lot of returning players this year um, coming back this year with playing experience including um, all NSIC second team performers and Chandra Hondrink and Ellie Van Der Steeg, including five um, seniors coming back. So that must be pretty refreshing to hear and know that you can rely on them for veteran leadership for this year. Well, you know, they've done a good job of uh, welcoming in the young kids, of redefining who we are. We've gone through a process of uh, establishing some new goals and a new way of doing things, and they've actually been the leaders in that regard. Um, well, we're appreciative of that. Uh, and Chandra's experience and Ellie's experience only make us better, but we're still we're still flushing out or flushing out who's going to be the the players and who's going to really contribute. Absolutely. Um, overall, how is the team looking in fall camp with the returning players and the um, couple of new faces that added into the mix this year? Um, how are they building chemistry? Are they gelling together? That's been going faster than we anticipated. But what we're really excited about is they haven't lost a lot of games that we achieved last spring. And the freshmen have stepped in and have actually kept up with the gains that we made. So the good news is is that we're better than we were last year at this time. However, the bad news is the competition for the positions is still pretty intense. Are there any things you're stressing more than other years this year to the team? Or? What we're really stressing this year is constant improvement. So if we can improve, constantly make improvements every day, it'll show up at the end of the year. So today is a really important day because it's not yesterday. And we need to get better today than we were yesterday. And if we can do that, and the way this league is structured, that's the only way you can succeed is to have continuous daily improvement. Absolutely. Um, how about the conference outlook for this year? Um, every year the NSIC has been known to be one of the best in the nation. I assume the same this year. Uh, as you can expect, um, tough competition for this year as well. Yeah, we, in fact, that's what makes it fun. Yep. So is it fun to get back to the yeah, for a while? But then eventually it becomes like, let's play somebody. And fortunately in this league, you get to play somebody every weekend who has the ability to beat you. That's why continuous improvement is so important. Oh, yeah. So we have the usual suspects, but in the end, it's going to depend upon who improves the most. Uh, Concordia, Duluth, Sam Swiss. I did not read them because they don't really make any difference. Mm -hmm. It matters how much you improve. Yep. All right. Well, finally, um, just over a week, you guys will be traveling to Golden, Colorado, um, competing in the or Digger Volleyball Classic, where you guys will be playing four teams in the span of two days. You must be pretty excited, looking forward to that early competition to get the season started. Oh, we are, and especially clever or digging. I get that, right? A volleyball tournament. Named That's Boyd. right. Yeah. Got to give them a lot of credit. That's Their right. head coach, Jamie, Jamie Scanlon's picture's right up there. She spent a year, two years here before she got the okay. job at the Colorado School of Mines. But yes, we're looking forward to that. You don't play a lot of preseason exhibitions, so... And you kind of have to treat it as a chance to find out where you stand and give players a chance to find out where they stand. So you go there to win and get better, but then you also have to find out what you got. So first weekends can sometimes be very interesting. We just know that we have to be better today than we were yesterday, and we have to be better on Friday than we are on Saturday, and we have to be better on Saturday and, we're in, and continuing on. When mm -hmm. we get back, then we got to get better again. So it's, it's, it's a learning experience for us, but the yeah, object is to try and win too and find out who can play. All right. Good. All right, Coach. Well, thanks for the time, and best oh, of luck welcome, to you man. and the rest of the team out in Colorado. We appreciate that. Thank you so much. No problem. Follow us on Twitter and Facebook. <laughs>